Okay, so we thought we would just do something short for you all uh, Christmas, answer some questions, and do a little year-end uh, review for you all, so enjoy! One question that gets asked a lot is what kind of background in construction we have. Well, I don't really have a background in construction um, other than just doing projects with Emmanuel at our, uh, some other homes that we've lived in and some renovations there. This is definitely the biggest project that I've ever gotten to be a part of and I've learned a lot already um, just coming along in um, different sections of the project and um, helping out when I can. So it's been great. I studied mechanical engineering, so that's kind of the background that I have from when it comes to everything in general. And then we come specifically to construction, to remodeling. Well, Julia and I um, fixed up one of our houses in Colorado ourselves um, that we sold when we moved out here to Virginia. Here in Virginia, we also fixed the last house that we owned a little bit, um, just did a uh, few little changes in the house that we didn't like and what we wanted to be make a little more modern and then while we were still living in Denver um, at the beginning I worked for a couple of my friends um, they had construction type businesses mainly window installment and door installment and outside sidings and new construction and also um, remodel um, windows but in general all other things like drywall, electrical, that's just um, by trying it out ourselves in one of the houses that we owned. What job would you never want to do in the house? You would hire somebody to do it. That job that we just finished. Which one? Always that we just finished. So it would have been nice to have somebody hired out, but uh, we obviously want to do the projects ourselves and after the fact um, it's it's okay but while you're doing it and you're doing it week every week again and again and again you always wonder what well, would have been nice if we hired somebody so you didn't have to do it ourselves but in general um, the only th real thing that I don't want to do is the roof I just don't like heights um, so that's one of the things and then um, I'm still debating when it comes to finishing the drywall the finishing the plaster um, it takes a lot of skill, takes a lot of experience, so to make it look nice and make it look perfect, we will probably hire that out um, because it's just, first of all, such a mess and then the experience that you have to have. What job would you not do? <laughs> um, taking out the dirty plumbing, <laughs> I would not do. <laughs> Are we going to move in next year? Maybe. We will see. Um, we have, I mean, it's not going to be at the beginning of the year, obviously. We have a lot of things still to do. Um, the major projects, obviously the roof, which is on schedule. We are trying to figure out exactly which company we want to use. And we have two options of fixing the slate and then um, doing a metal roof. So those kind of two options we are weighing right now and also trying to get some quotes and some timelines and then what well, we're working on electrical um, after the electrical we have to finish the plumbing we have to glue it all together um, then we can probably get ex um, an inspection done for the electrical and the plumbing well then we have to do siding the windows before we can do the siding and then we have to do insulation before we can actually put the drywall on the, the plaster on and then the finishing touches uh, so lots of more work we will probably not finish the entire house at once um, we'll just focus on as soon as we get the big projects that we just have to do all at once um, we'll do all the the finishing touches like drywall um, in sections of the house as we're going and potentially we might move in in half the house if we get it done we might not have a kitchen at the beginning we might just have a temporary kitchen as we are working on getting the final one um, and we'll just see how that goes what job should people always do themselves do you think if they can well if they can as well, much as possible <laughs> everything they can do it saves a lot of money and yeah. the other thing reason why we're doing it ourselves is 
we can make the decisions ourselves exactly the way we want it. Um, we don't have to worry about uh, this contractor include um, a job a certain way in their quotes. So this way we really get to get it to do it the exact uh, way we can do it. We can make changes on the fly without having to be here all the time Permission. where you get yeah. um, talk to the contractors. So I would say as, as long as you can, as long as you're capable of doing it yourself, you're learning a lot. Um, it's, it has been a great experience. We, we have changed things uh, over time. We make mistakes um, and we learn and, um, you know, it prepares us for the next thing that we do. Well, that's all about all that I have. But if you have a question that we didn't talk about, feel free to write it in the comments and we'll talk about it another time. And I would just want to wish you all a wonderful Christmas and time, um, hopefully some time off and some time to rest and enjoy your loved ones. And um, thank you all. We'll see you next time. Thanks. Merry Christmas. Bye. Bye.